Hey, good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the Morning Sip. Uh, we're having a fun time here at the Mississippi Ag Museum. And, Jade, this morning we're joined by Hayes Patrick. Hayes, you're the director here at the Ag Museum, right? Right, yes, sir. Thanks for waking up with us this morning. Yeah, thank you all for coming. So, this is something that families might even see if they swing by the Ag Museum tomorrow. Can you tell us what's been going on this week? So, we're having our annual Harvest Fest. Uh, where small town Mississippi comes to life, mm -hmm. and uh, this is just one of the things that families can expect uh, tomorrow or today is uh, cast iron cooking demonstrations. Um, that's when we say small town coming to life. All of our buildings, all of our um, like the print shop and the blacksmith and the mm -hmm. cotton gin and the sawmill, everything is running. Uh, thankfully, for a lot of volunteers and demonstrators here to help us make that happen. Uh, Barry is our director of maintenance here, and he and his wife. Just like that, volunteer to come and help and, and show everybody some good southern cooking. Yummy. Yeah, so Jade, you're kind of eyeing the food over here. Maybe you can figure out what's cooking this morning. Yeah, so Barry, tell us about you've been cooking up this ham, and I know we got some delicious biscuits going on. Um, talk about the process here. I mean, this is kind of an old way of cooking. Yeah, the uh, cast iron cooking's been around for many, many years. Uh, what we have right here, we've got a Dutch oven. We've got our uh, fresh uh, homemade biscuits and that. Uh, right here in this skillet, we're cooking some ham as we speak right now, and we had just pulled some sausage out of there. Mm. Mm, so it's going to be good. It looks delicious, Mr. Barry. And Laminda over here, uh, she was uh, rolling out the biscuits, and we got that in the Dutch oven, too. Yep, yep, that's good. Y'all want to take a look at it? Yeah, yeah let's, let's do it. Let's look inside the Dutch oven and see what's... Because, Jade, if, any, if anyone knows me, everyone knows that I love biscuits. Those look yummy. I think they're done. Yeah. Almost? Almost done? Okay. Laminda, is there any type of secret sauce to these type of biscuits that you put in the Dutch oven? It's, it's, it's your love that makes it yummy, right? <laughs> wow. And so, so this, I mean, because people still cook with cast iron these days, but I guess uh, not as common to have it outside with kind of the fire and coals as we've done before, right? That's right. Yep, this is the old, old way of doing it right here. <laughs> mm. yeah, it is. Yeah, we, are, we are loving this. Uh, yeah, the coffee's not quite ready yet, but I, I'm getting ready, for, getting ready for that. I've never had campfire coffee like this. Well, cowboy coffee, as we call it, as, as because it's cooked over the campfire. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, it's looking delicious. So we got the whole crew out here, Jacob. Yeah, yeah, we really appreciate y'all waking up with us this morning. And so, Hayes, we're just in one small part here of the Ag Museum, um, and there's lots of other things. And you said today there's going to be a lot of school groups coming through? Yes, yeah, so we're expecting 1,500 people here today. A um, lot, of, lot of field trips uh, coming out. Uh, the good thing about there's 40 acres here. So uh, I know there's some concerns still about COVID and things like that, but this is predominantly an outside event. Of course, we have the gallery where they can all go in in their indoor exhibits, but this is an outdoor event. It's beautiful weather. It's a great time to, to experience all of it. Yeah, it is. Yeah, okay, so this is lovely. I'm ready, I'm ready to get some food. Jade, can you serve me a plate over there? And I think we're also going to go check in on Frank with the horse and buggy, so stay tuned here the morning sip. We'll be back from the Ag Museum after this.